Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. Okay, so uh, he we're here at another equipment tour at my papa's farm. We have a lot of equipment. He's a big farmer. If you're talking about a big farmer, this is the guy you want to know. Um, so let me put my pill wipers on and let's get started. Okay, so first off. Um, Like a 2020, 2021 base, I think. I only got the new. I, I, this is brand new, I think. Um, um, still has the writing on the tires, still has the stickers. This, I'm gonna have to say, this thing has to be like a 2022. And then we got the Massey Ferguson Hest, Heston Baylor. To uh, um, show them the number on it so they can read that. And then, well, that, that Heston Baylor has a flat tire. We got, um, I think it's our uh, cultivator. Um, um, we got a S780. I think that was an S7 set F. I don't really know. You guys can go back through it. But that's three combines in a row. That one's brand new, that's a 2021, that's a 2021, I think. Those two are the same exact number, I think. And then we got the brand new, um, this. Um, this does not have the stickers on his tire, on the tires. This, um, he had for a little bit. He, you know, he probably used it. Um, so this is a John Deere. 340 8R. Um, let me go track this. Then we have the big, the big guns right here. Nine, uh, 9520 RT. Tracks. Funky tractor. Okay. I guess so. Come on. Give me the camera. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Whoa. This is the cab that well we're gonna go um this still has um the cab smell it smells really really good and then well let's stay up here for um the sprayer um this, this is not a sprayer it's a fertilizer sprayer um and it's a R forty forty five John Deere um fraud spur. I like how um they put these two giant white tires on it. I like it because it gives it more ro rotation. But the only thing I don't like about them is it sucks to get them off. Then we have a B D B sixty. Um, this is a. 1775 NT. These are both planters. You guys probably already know that. The white tires are on here too. And then, well, four combines. He has all four combines. This one, that one's new too. That one's brand new too. This thing, um, it's I'm going to say it's a 2021 too. It's basically the same exact one, I think. It's probably a S780. Just say that. Um, this shed hasn't been, uh, shed hasn't been built very long ago. Um, I think it's locked, but I think we have some semis in here. I don't know if it's unlocked or locked. So, uh, let me see if it's locked. I doubt it is. Yep, so I thought. 
and then so um I come over here to the shed and we have our wheel loader um I believe much as my drive cost but still do and we have our John Deere 775 NT I think this is the same exact model this thing is brand new that tractor is brand new well I'm small enough that I can go under here I think my mom is too uh, yeah and then we have our our uh, load our, I think it's uh I don't 
bomb team over there. We got a hydro tank, some other miscellaneous stuff. Scales. We had the scales over there. Um, but my mom had to remind me. Uh, but, um, still more. We're saving the best machine for the last. Um, this is probably going to be the longest video that I'm, I, I have posted. I know I said that in another video. But, all right, hang on. Like, uh, that one's good for now. Let's get in the car and go. So you can put part one, part two. Oh, I don't really know how to put... Well, you just put, like, you just post the first one. No, I'm not, I'm not going to post the first one and then the second one. Why? It's, it's, it's just going to be ridiculous. That there, that I have to go to one video and then another video. Well, it'll be part one and then they'll want to see part two. need to come in and weigh because if people come in and need to weigh they do? yeah <sighs> why don't make you put on your seatbelt so it won't ning You know it's still videoing. Okay, so we're here. We have um the cat. Um nine thirty eight K. Okay. Some uh, good loader. Oh yeah, just the miscellaneous stuff. You guys can all stop the video and look at that. Then we have the little John Deere 6145M little utility tractor then we have the hay shed this is where they keep the hay all those round bales are very crappy really no one uses those then we have other farm way down there we already filmed that part we're gonna edit that in then we have um a um we well, have the silage pit over there all the way over there, you probably can't see it. I have a gooseneck with these little grain bin. I don't really know what they're called. But then we have the shed where um, we really have just all the semi tires. And then we have another tank. We have some tractor tires, semi tower, trailer tires. And we have the feed truck. We have the feed truck right there. We have a old blown up engine that no one uses. Okay, um, this feed truck, let me see, let me see. Um, go look in room. Okay, so this is an international feed truck. And then we have just a Jeep, a miscellaneous Jeep. I don't really know whose this is. And then we have, um, I don't really know what that is. You guys can probably find out. And we have an old Chevy right there. I think that, that engine that I showed you guys was the one that went to it. So um, I will uh, catch, you, catch you guys back up whenever we get to the other parts. We got the 
first tractor I think my papa has ever had on his car. And I got this. I know this is unlocked. I got the side door. This, this thing, um, okay. Oh, this thing's old. It's very old. It's not running. Probably all I need to put some diesel or gas in it, and then it'll run. And a new battery and some tires. We got the old 4020. This thing, these are beautiful. Um, this old beautiful. These things, you can find them kind of easy, not really. But whenever I get older, I'm going to fix this thing up, put some new tires on it, get some new rims. Clean it up. It's it. You know, old tractors have to leak oil. It's the basically the basic thing. Um. But then it's a great tractor. Just needs to wash and there's heat. Some stuff that most tractors probably need. So, well. I guess, um, we'll see you guys on the next one.